Good evening, I'm Shamika Neely. After months of complaints and concerns regarding child safety and welfare within the Department of Child Services, the General Assembly began reviewing the agency on Tuesday. Both Republicans and Democrats have expressed concerns about DCS ranging from high caseworker turnover to the centralization of the agency's hotline. The Democrats on the committee are asking for at least two of five scheduled meetings to take place outside of the State House in locations around Indiana. A 10-year-old Bloomfield boy has been selected as an Indiana ambassador by Riley Children's Foundation. B.J. Yoho, born with spina bifida, puts others first in his community by organizing toy drives around Christmas time and encourages other children with serious medical obstacles. His efforts are being paid forward, and Wednesday he was honored by the Riley Children's Foundation as the 2012 Children Miracle Network Hospitals Champion for Indiana. In September, Yoho will have the opportunity to visit the nation's capital and Walt Disney World. The IU football team is nine days away from its first game of the season. After a 1-11 season and losing record 0-8 in the Big Ten Conference last year, the IU football team is looking to turn things around now. IU head football coach Kevin Wilson says it's important that the team limit mistakes on the field and use their depth to run the ball as they prepare for next week's game. I think offensively, uh, probably maybe a little bit more complete as far as pieces of the puzzle where the lines can be consistent. Uh, you know, a decent player tied in, a couple, you know, three, four receivers, a couple, three running backs, a quarterback that's getting good, not only being able to move around but throw. So uh, a little more complete on offense. Defensively, uh, more speed, but just, you know, you know, consistently, you know, be in the right spot. Make, and make, so if we're working on things, it's making tackles. If we're working on things, it's creating turnovers. If we're working on things, it's trying to be better in a kick game. The first football game of the season is next Saturday against Indiana State University. Your weather tonight, clear, lows in the lower 50s. Tomorrow, sunny highs in the upper 80s. Tomorrow night, mostly clear, lows in the upper 50s. Let's take a look at your five-day forecast. On Friday, it's going to be mostly sunny, highs around 90, lows around 60. Saturday, mostly clear, highs in the upper 80s, lows in the upper 60s.